She Hulk smash. How's it going everybody and welcome back. I'm Dusty Mac and thank you so very much for joining me on this She-Hulk season one finale. This one is season one episode nine. Whose show is this? Uh, last time on She-Hulk we had the uh, basically the premiere of Daredevil in the MCU. All the way back in No Way Home we had Matt Murdock appear uh, to help Spider-Man with some of his legal troubles. Uh, and as we saw that last episode, Jen looked like she was about to be arrested, so she might need some of Matt Murdock's help in this episode. Being that this episode is called Whose Show Is This, I'm guessing it's going to have more Matt Murdock, which, you know, that's never a bad thing. So yeah, it's 3 a.m. I really just want to jump into this and finish off season one. Uh, but I, I just, I can't even believe we're already here at the very end. You know, usually these, uh, these Marvel shows are about six episodes. Rarely do we get nine episodes. But it just seems like these have gone by so fast. Every, every, every week I've been looking forward to the show and seeing what we get. And I'm never disappointed. The retreat episode I just got done editing today. And it's... The edit and the episode weren't my favorite. <laughs> it just There's not a lot in that episode, uh, but it quickly picked up, and then we got so much more. Uh, so I'm really excited about this episode, and I hope you are too. So if you like this reaction want to keep seeing more just like it, please make sure you hit that like button. And if you find yourself keep coming back and you're not subscribed, go ahead and subscribe and hit that little bell in the corner because it'll tell you when my next video comes out, which is usually every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And I also do some bonus videos and barely stream. And if you guys want to support the channel financially, the Patreon and everything else is down below. And with the Patreon, you're going to get these reactions full length and a week or weeks before the YouTube audience. So if that interests you, go check that out. If not, they'll be up here on the YouTubes eventually. Uh, so yeah, I guess without any further ado, let's go ahead and finish off this first season of She-Hulk in style again. This one is season one, episode nine. Whose show is this? Let's do it. Bum, 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 bum. Jennifer Walters, lawyer, millennial. <laughs> Jesus. An accidental dose of gamma radiated blood. <laughs> it's just like the 90s, no, the 80s Hulk show. Was angry or outraged. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of dig this. Driven by rage and pursued by online trolls. You wouldn't like me when I'm angry. Or no, Hulk was in the 70s, wasn't it? Wow. I think. <laughs> Savage Shield. Oh, they put her in. Emil Blonsky's cell? Guess no Matt. Whose show is this anyway? <laughs> we need to identify every individual who hacked my private information. They baited you and you took the bait. I was angry! Anyone would respond in that situation. But you're not just anyone. You are an out of control Hulk. She's like the most in control Hulk, even with Banner. We have an offer for a plea deal. The incident. What are the terms? Can't be She-Hulk anymore, huh? And this is how they cancel the show? Goddamn men on Twitter. <laughs> Oh, that like goes into her leg. It's pretty invasive. <laughs> For some reason, I thought that was Captain America, Steve Rogers version. I was like, what the hell is he doing here? See you later, litigator. Can't be the superhero Hulk lawyer because can't be the Hulk anymore. Terms of the deal permanently bar Jennifer Walters from transforming into her She-Hulk. I'm TMZ. Do you care to comment about losing your superpowers? My gym stuff is in your room now, and you should join me. Oh, this will be fun. I don't like seeing Jen. Like, she, Jen has pretty much had nothing but, like, bad things happen to her this entire series. The accident, being turned into a Hulk against her will, horrible dating life, people treating her like shit. What do you got for me? We know that Hulk King is the admin <laughs> on Intelligentsia, and it is owned by several shell companies. How am I supposed to sue these guys if I don't know who they are? Let's search all the basements. <laughs> you might get a kick out of this video that Jen and her friends no, made in Los Angeles. No, 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 no. <laughs> She had Cosima hair and she was shaking it like Crystal right there. I like that. <laughs> oh boy. Jen. We worked together at the district attorney's office. Dated for a significant... Was that the douchebag? Way before she got those superpowers. I blame her grandmother. Huh? <laughs> Why her grandmother? Can you move the big bookcase for me? Not no. anymore. You can't be Girl Hulk anymore. <laughs> girl it's Hulk. She Hulk, Mom. Was. But never again. This isn't even a reluctant superhero story. I'm just getting screwed over. Is this what you guys want? No. Jennifer Walters is a woman at a new low. She has no more no, fighting. No, we're not her. doing a narrator. We're not that off the rail. Yo, I thought that was the watcher for a second. I was like, oh, okay. Is this what we're going to get? <laughs> Smug Hulk. Okay, well. well, you said come anytime. This is a time. <laughs> I mean, if you got the actor, you might as well use them all you want, right? I'm not running from my problems. It's a mental health break. Didn't you just have that like two episodes ago when you went to the retreat? And this bid of She-Hulk in college. Forgive me, Jen, for this transgression. Oh, she's trying to bait him. What a whale tail. <laughs> well, 
Okay, well, that was easy. <laughs> Super easy, barely an inconvenience. I think they're just very dumb. I'm gonna oh, need the other are guy. You still here? I need a favor. <laughs> I need a bro. What a pleasant surprise. I just need a place to stay for a couple of days. Of course, I know. Okay. <laughs> Deep the goose. The that is a really bad Photoshop the job, by the way, on, on a meal. This book sucks. <laughs> I'm going to be on the phone with you the entire time. I need you to blend in with these trolls, okay? And remember to always refer to women as females. <laughs> Those females. We're all part of the He-Man Woman Haters Club. <laughs> Why does there even need to be a She-Hulk? It's not like there's a Lady Thor? And I'm yes. not just saying that because she's a female. Females, am I right? <laughs> Mother Pugger. Con? Oh, wait, that tracks. <laughs> of course you're one of us. Oh, that was one of the date dudes, right? And the one that was in the law office. You heard it from me first. Right. He rules. And he's hot. Yeah, <laughs> Look at, wait, what? Sounds a little sus, bruh. Is she as strong as him? Is she as smart as him? That doesn't matter. No. She's as cool as the Hulk. That's all that matters. Hulk is stronger though. But then again, he got the full dose of the gam gamma, so makes sense. The power should go to the best person suited for the job. She got everything through nepotism. Yeah. 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 That big word that you use, I know what that is. <laughs> yes. Like you're mad about it. Yeah, and it pisses me off. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Mm. Uh, uh, primal. Gross. Keep him talking about something <laughs> relevant. How did you get involved with this group? I created Intelligentsia. Got I'm him. Okay. We're just getting started. So Joshua wasn't hulking then. I just kind of put that together. I don't think anybody can really understand what I'm going through except Emil since he went through literally the exact same thing. Do you know where he is? He's down on lunch. Some private event down there. Thanks. Uh oh. Give it up for the abomination! What? A meal. It's really an honor to be your humble life coach for the evening. So, wait, they're on his property? How did they not know that when they were driving there? Be powerful! Be powerful! Oh. You are the only boss. Emil? Jennifer. How is he transforming? You've been transforming into the abomination. Strictly for profit. I vouch for you. <laughs> what? Oh, no. Two, two females? <laughs> Todd created the site. He's Hulk King. I hired him to seduce you and steal your blood. My team also synthesized your blood so it could safely give me all the powers you never should have been given in the first place. He injected himself with her blood? Oh. He just made a mm. Hulk steroid. <laughs> Doing this. I don't know. It's it's kind of book logic. Oh no! I mean, he deserved this, but this can't possibly be where this season was going. <laughs> Come at me, bro! <laughs> oh, surprise, losers! Titania too isn't messy enough. Watch out! Oh, okay, okay, Emil. Feels like the Wayne's World movie at the very end, where everything's just kind of happening all at once. Oh, this is a mess. How did Bruce None get back? These storylines make any sense. Is this working for you? <laughs> hey, what do you think you're doing? This menu is not gonna stop me. All right. Ah, marvelous hemp. <laughs> what the fuck? What is happening? What the hell is happening right now? Is this an eighth wall break? I, I don't know what we're witnessing here. So is she in the real world? Are they pulling like what Supernatural did? Where Sam and Dean went into the real world where they're shooting? Yeah. Holy shit. Like you couldn't have just broken the door. The entirety of the second season is one extended dream sequence. <laughs> have an inhibitor. Yeah, where's the inhibitor? <laughs> is everything okay? What? What kind of stupid finale is this? Yeah, like fun and kind of a kind of a twist. A twist? Yeah. The bad guy steals my blood in order to give himself superpowers. Where did you come up with that? Was that from every other superhero story <laughs> ever? Okay. These writers really wrote themselves into the show. I don't know if they're real writers though. I want to talk to Kevin. Is Kevin Feige a character in the MCU now? No one talks to Kevin. This is very creepy, the way you're talking about him. I don't even care about any more of the storylines. I love everything about this. She-Hulk. I'm here to see Kevin. Let me just have you sign our non-disclosure agreement. <laughs> Why'd you make me sign if you were just going to do that? Everyone has to sign the NDA. <laughs> <laughs> She's a superhero. Why are they attacking her? <laughs> this is super ridiculous. I love everything about it. Oh, <laughs> 
Does he have like a villain bunker? <laughs> He's watching all the Marvel things at once. What is this? <laughs> is that Kevin Feige? Hello, Jennifer. Kevin? <laughs> Hat. Were you expecting a man? Yeah. Why would I expect a giant AI brain? So and stupid. Not a I man? love it. You're the one who's making all the decisions here. You must first transform back to Jennifer. Why? You are very expensive. Better? <laughs> Thank you. I love that so much. Super self-aware. Produces near perfect products. Near perfect. Some are better than others, but I leave that debate up to the internet. Well. Kevin, I'm not happy with what's happening in my story. It is a legal comedy, and I would like to give my closing argument. The Marvel Cinematic Universe. Big spectacles. It's often said that Marvel movies all end the same way. Wait, who's saying that? I love Tatiana in that suit, by the way. Just saying. Blood thing that seems super suspiciously close to Super Soldier Serum at the audience. <laughs> or Titan formula. I propose we don't have to do that distracts from the story right when i was learning to be both jen and she hulk those are my stakes kevin processing this new data what is the ending you propose kevin. can we not do todd gets hulk powers erasing blood plot oh and, and bruce <laughs> swooping down from literal outer space to save the day in my story uh -uh. bruce is supposed to return to explain what he was no, doing no no, no we don't need to hear any of that yeah we do to introduce uh, save it for the movie calculate which one which movie whose movie the hulk's movie solo i just want him to hold himself accountable okay let's do this big climax in daylight yes I would not mind seeing daredevil again a woman has needs. <laughs> we all have needs, Jen. Well, I've got you here. You are sitting. What's with all the daddy issues? Tony Stark, daddy issues. Jen. Thor, daddy issues. Loki, same daddy, same issue. Oh, boy. Star Lord, two daddies. When are we getting the X-Men? I cannot tell yes. you that. Yes! Okay. That's you will not be able to access the K-E-V-I-N again. That's it? We're done? You obliterated the thrilling ending Kevin formulated. That's what Hulks do. We smash things. Bruce smashes buildings, I smash fourth walls, and bad ending. And sometimes Matt Murdock. <laughs> she Hulk smash. See you on the big screen. Yes. Really? Yes, no. yes. Oh, whatever, Aww. Kevin. She'll be there. She'll be there. Should I transform back? What's the most budget-friendly way to do this? Tatiana is gonna be the rest of the show, I guess. Stop. Oh, okay. You're about to witness a murder. Just do it. I'll see you in court, babe. <laughs> Where did he fall from? I'm here to help. Hey, Daredevil. We're done. Sorry. Everything? <laughs> God, did they hook up? I completely ship them. Please stay in the show. If you sign this, you go back to prison for 10 years for violating your parole. See, comic price, I pay for my actions. Matt joined the family. Hell yes. I love this. Jen tells me you have your own practice in the house kitchen. You hear that, Rebecca? His own practice? It's not very glamorous, but it's where I grew up. See, this seems like too happy of an ending. Something's got to happen. Welcome to my life. Hey, everyone. Bru oh, hell yeah, yeah. Bruce is back. Oh, oh, hold on. I've been away on Sakaar for a while. Tell you all about it. First, I have someone here that I'd like you all to meet. This is my son, Scar. Oh. Wow, your family. What? They're just giving everybody the kids. Thor got a daughter. Now, Sakaar's here. I do know that Hulk had a son, but I didn't think we were going to get that anytime soon. Your lawsuit against Todd Phelps and Intelligentsia. Have to be held responsible for their actions. If you attack, harm, or harass innocent people, I'm coming for you. In the courtroom or as a superhero? Yes. Both. <laughs> Who are you wearing to court today? Okay. <laughs> Yeah, she's not gonna buy into that shit. Damn, that was so unpredictably good. Oh, we're gonna get a little bit. We're gonna get a little bit. A little after after credit. You took your time. <laughs> Yo, my apologies for the delay. You got sucked into another show, didn't you? We're really in an era of peak TV. What's the guest policy at Carpetage? What about Wi Fi? Yeah, Wi Fi. Well, how do you think he can access his Netflix, man? All right, so meals out. And apparently he's a good guy because Wong wouldn't just harbor him if he was still evil. All right, everybody, that was the season one finale of She-Hulk Attorney at Law. That one was episode nine, Whose Show Is This? And uh, now we know for sure whose show this is because the show starts just like any other show, basically. And, <laughs> you know, she's getting fired. Everything seems to be just piling on Jen. <laughs> And then, like, because I even mentioned, I was like, wait a minute, why wouldn't her friends know that that was going to be a meal's compound that they're driving to? And why was Abomination talking at this intelligentsia meeting? How did Abomination get his restraint off? And 
uh, how did that guy turn her blood into a serum? And then fucking Hulk just flies in out of nowhere and it's like, where did he come from? It's because nothing was making sense. And it was making such little sense that even Jen was like, hold on, wait a minute. And she <laughs> escaped through our Disney Plus app and then she like went into the real world and she was able to talk to Kevin Feige, which, you know, was just a, a, a an AI called Kevin. I don't even know how to describe what this episode was. Like she said it was like a fourth wall break. Like I said, that was like an eighth or sixteenth wall break. She's playing some like Tesseract geometry in this in this MCU. But she talked to Kevin and you know, she laid out a lot of the uh, the recent MCU flaws of late, and they had the kind of an understanding, and she was able to fix her show, and she just kind of went back, and everything was pretty much wrapped up, obviously. But then, you know, Kevin did drop the hint that there's a movie, which is obviously is going to be Hulk's movie, which she'll have to be in it, because she is now the aunt of Sakaar. I, I'm pretty sure that was his name. Scar, not Sakaar. Sakaar, I think, is from, like, Star Trek or Doctor Who or something. I do recognize that name, but how did he get a son so quickly? I guess, well, I guess he was on that planet for a long time, and time moves differently over there, I guess. Definitely some big implications, and like I said, they're, they're making everybody have kids now. Like, like, Thor had a daughter from Thor Love and Thunder, which I did not like that movie. <laughs> There's only a couple MCU movies I don't like, and that join the list now hulk has a son so it's like wow they're just bringing in a whole bunch of new characters really quickly and that kind of makes me nervous because i do know that like secret war is coming up that's the uh the, the next avengers movie are they bringing in a lot of new characters so they can have people to kill off and make the stakes high or could they kill off mainstays like bruce banner and then scar takes over i, I don't know but yeah, and then of course, you know, Matt Murdock's there, which I, I love Jen and Matt together. Uh, I know that he's not going to be like in the show mainstay, but I, I, I really like them together. And maybe they can like meet up in the next Avengers movie or something. But anyway, guys, what did you think of this season one finale? For me, this is what the show should be. And unfortunately, Jen argued against that and she won. So I, don't, I think it's going to go maybe more towards the, the, the courtroom comedy. But again, now we know what the show is capable of. I have no idea what they're going to pull off in season two. So anyway, guys, let me know what you thought about this episode in the comment box down below. And if you like my reaction, want to keep seeing more just like it, please make sure you hit that like button for the algorithm and subscribe and hit that little bell in the corner because it'll tell you when my next video comes out, which is usually every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And I also do some bonus videos and barely stream. And if you guys want to support the channel financially, the Patreon and everything is down below. And with the Patreon, you're going to get these reactions full length and a week or weeks before the YouTube audience. So if that interests you, please go check that out. If not, they'll be up here eventually. Yeah, that's going to be about it for me for the night. Uh, so like I said, uh, next week I am going to be doing uh, Werewolf by Night, I think it's called. That'll just be like a, a bonus video for you guys because I have been wanting to watch it. But other than that, I don't know what the next uh, MCU show is going to be or when it's going to come out. Because I think the next movie is uh, Black Panther 2. So I don't know when I'm going to be able to see that just because it's I'm not going to go to the movie theater. Uh, so yeah, I don't know when we're going to get any more Marvel, and it's kind of sad. I know people are like kind of exhausted with it, but I don't care. Just keep releasing new shows over and over and over, and I will consume them. <laughs> so yeah, anyway guys, thank you so very much for joining me. I love and appreciate every single one of you. And remember, if you're going to go outside, keep wearing a mask, and don't be an ass. And I will see you all next week for some more. No, I won't. Wow. Sorry, I've been hitting this. Uh, I guess I will see you when I see you. Thank you so much for joining me, and I hope to see you in the comments of another one of my videos. Take it easy, guys. Come at me, bro!